to increase my bar sales. What are some things I can do? First of all, and this is going to sound like it's flippant, but it's not, hire good-looking bartenders. <laughs> it, it's amazing. You take good-looking women and you have them be bartenders, and you take butt-ugly women and you have them be bartenders, and look at the difference in sales. Now, interestingly enough, if I take good-looking men and have them be bartenders, and I take butt-ugly men and have them be bartenders, there is a difference, but it's not as extreme. The reason that is, men and women will follow good-looking women, but men and women won't follow good-looking men. So if you take good-looking bartenders that are women, what you'll find is in time in the marketplace, there's this little talk that happens you got to go over to XYZ Bar because this one bartender that's over there, she is not dead gorgeous. And I like going over there. Now, the discussion becomes how you define good looking. It's not always what you think. Really, in our industry, good looking is defined as hospitable, friendly, personal, eye contact, make me feel like we're buddies, and do it with a little bit of sex appeal. That doesn't mean that a good looking bartender has to show a bunch of skin, doesn't mean they have to be a model. What it means is they have to be able to connect to the person sitting at the other side of the bar. Because when a person goes into a bar, they're looking for a short term friend. Now, physical attributes don't hurt. Good-looking woman who knows how to take care of herself, who knows how to be professionally feminine, who knows how to dress the right way, who knows how to show just the right amount of cleavage, who knows how to smile at just the right time, who knows how to laugh at just the right jokes, that is defined as good looking. I have seen plenty of women that are not dead physically beautiful and they do miserable jobs in a bar because they can't connect with the customer. They, aren't, they can't do the eye contact. They can't giggle, smile, be feminine, be professional, and therefore the customer can't stand them. Again, does that mean you should stay away from male bartenders? No, there's plenty of good male bartenders. It's just the impact isn't as severe. In other words, people are more tolerant of butt-ugly males than they are butt-ugly females, especially when they're in a bar. That's just... <laughs>